Well, today is all about trees, so let's not think about taxes. It's North Carolina Arbor Day. Meteorologist KJ Jacobs explaining what Arbor Day means to the Tar Heel State. Fun fact, the pine is the state tree for North Carolina and the eastern white pine is the tallest tree measuring at 180 feet based on height alone in Jackson County. The simple act of planting has deep roots in the state of North Carolina. Pride in the canopy, but also, you know, trying to restore and you know, give back to the environment a bit where we, we do so much developing and removing trees where a lot of it's necessary, but if you can go and replenish in certain areas, um, it's a great thing and Charlotte does well at that. Arborist Matt Betts with Davy Tree says the variety of tree species are endless, even in Uptown. The stadium is a good example of, you know, how they've introduced different species of trees and pine trees and live oaks to kind of restore what has been lost over the years. Arbor Day is traditionally celebrated on the last Friday in April. In North Carolina, the tree planting holiday falls in mid-March before summer's heat. Still, late fall is the best time to plant. It's more significant that you focus on what area you have to work with, um, water conditions, shade conditions, things like that. So anything native, you know, oaks, pines, red buds are going to do great in this area. Aside from its natural beauty, a healthy tree provides clean air, shade, and habitat for wildlife. And here's what Betts recommends you to plant on Arbor Day. Like a red bud or a dogwood, something more ornamental because you're going to get to see the value from it sooner, where if you plant like an oak, or a maple or a poplar, it's gonna take longer for that tree to develop. Today, Trees Charlotte, in partnership with the city of Charlotte, says they will give away more than 150 canopy builders to the city of Charlotte residents. I'm meteorologist KJ Jacobs, WCNC Charlotte.